Hi. Welcome to Love and Forever Evolving, where we are always and forever evolving. Hello, my loves. Grand Rising. Grand evening, wherever you are. Thank you so much for tuning in today, Gems. We're going to do a energy check-in to see who is in your energy here today, Gems, and why. All right. Definitely, if the reading here resonates for you, like, subscribe. All right. We would love to have you here part of the family. And if you would like to book a personal reading, Gems, the details are down below in the description box. All right. Thank you so much for sharing your time with me today. And shout out to my soul family, gang gang. If you'd like to be a part of the soul family, don't forget to subscribe to the memberships that are on the channel here or on Patreon. All right. So let's dive in, gems. Let's see who is in your energy. Wow. We have here the, this is more like the queen of wands. Yes. Okay. So this is an energy here of, Someone in your energy may be some way either, you know, trying to put things in your way. Jealous here is the energy I'm getting here, Gemini. Okay, because this is the seven of wands. This is that energy. You could just see it in her face, right, Gems? You know, I feel like this is kind of like your environment. This is your peace. This is you being to yourself you're in your own home you're in your own area okay we got to get all the way down this road to get to you so you're minding your business and i feel like there is someone that may be trying to step over some boundaries here that you are connecting here with okay we got the will of fortune at the bottom of the deck but know that everything is going to be okay even though people may be trying to pick at you um, you know, be all in your space and in your energy and just be disrespectful, just stepping over the line here. Do know that this is going to end up working out in your favor, whoever or whatever this is that may be trying to be against you. All right. Know that this situation is just going to fall off. Okay. Whatever someone is trying to get you to get upset about. It's not going to work, okay? And you are going to be a conf confirmation of that, all right? Somebody may have tried to do like a tactic on you. And this is not nothing to scare you. This is just me being honest on what I'm intuitively feeling and picking up here with the cards and the energy here is that someone is just upset because they can't go against what you don't already put in place. This is something, Gemini, that you already put in place. You already done this. You already set these boundaries here for whoever this person here is. And it just sounds like that this person here is upset. You know what I'm saying? They're upset because you're not doing what they want you to do. Okay. So by you not doing what you want them to do, they do little dumb tactics like this. You could just see it in the energy here of the cat. Okay. Um, this is just an energy where they're watching you with the Page of Swords energy. They're trying to pick up information about you, okay? And then we have the Ace of Wands because you have some type of new opportunity here coming. Some of y'all, you may have met someone new that's a very attractive. They could be a fire sign, a Sagittarius, a Leo, or an Aries here. And then we have coming out here is the, this is the Seven of Swords. Yeah, some of y'all, this person could be an air sign like yourself. This could be Aquarius, a Gemini, or a Libra. Now, what I seem to be picking up here is that with this high priestess here, this could be a Pisces as well, Gemini, and the Ace of Wands. This is something like I mentioned, you already know who this person is and what they're agenda here is you already know as much as they watch you as much as they have to go all out their way you intuitively already done picked up the deception here with the seven of swords what's the deception here what is the deception here for gemini placements 
what is the deception here with the we got here the five of cups mm. I'm sorry the six of cups I'm still learning the deck here but this is the energy here of someone that hurt you I clarify the seven of swords which talks about deception so the five of cups is you being hurt feeling disappointment regret and this is how i feel like how this queen of wands energy here feels which is you gemini okay we have the this is how many this is okay three four five yeah five of coins so this is someone that feels left out in the cold here this is your ex basically the person here that is still watching you, who is still trying to pick up information about you here, and they're still observing you. Clarify the Seven of Swords, which is not new over here in this neighborhood. You always have someone different every day of the week that's watching you. You have a new person every day of the week that watches you. So what else is new here, okay? We have here the Temperance Sagittarius Energy, your opposite zodiac sign. All right. You don't already balance the situation out spiritually, mentally, and emotionally. And you you ain't trying to hear this. You already know what time it is. The high priestess is here. You're intuitive as fuck. You're already five beats ahead of this person. As much as they watch you, they gonna just have to get a uh, you know, a reality check. And to you, it's just like a walk in the park. We got the mm, how many? This is six of pentacles. Yes, I love it. You're sharpening the fuck up. Look, listen. In the back of your mind, you don't already make peace with this person. So as much as they watch you, it's not going to throw you off is what I want you to understand, which is you already understand and overstand. I just now understand. Mm -hmm. I don't pick everything apart here. Let's go ahead and see how this person feels. Okay. So since they rudely interrupted here, Gemini, they got something to say. We got, they don't make me feel like you. Yeah, okay, I'm sure of that, okay? We got yes here, so maybe you prayed about the situation. Maybe you had questions about this. Maybe you wanted to know something particularly here. Maybe you prayed about this and you asked your spirit team, your guardian angels or your ancestors to show you a sign or give you a response. For some of you all, here's your yes. Here's your response. The answer is yes okay and then we have i believe you so i feel like whatever you try to confront this person about because i see here with the temperance card with the six of pentacles you try to make this work you try to as much best to your knowledge to give this person a chance because you actually had feelings for this person you literally did you know what i'm saying but the fact that this person did the bullshit you know what i'm saying you it was you just you fed up with it. You done all you could do at this point. There's nothing else at this point. This person will have to do all the work. Yeah, we got no love lost because that's exactly how you two feel. You both will always have love for each other. It's just unfortunate that this person is not in the space mentally, logically to see the situation for what it truly is. You know what I'm saying? They got to get out of their emotions as well. Just like you have to put your emotions to the side to figure this out. Okay. Yeah. We got, I see you in my dreams. This person definitely does a lot of seeing you everywhere. Okay. All right. Wow. So that is what we have here for you, Jim. This is your energy check-in here for today. I definitely hope this gave you some clarity, some insight. Definitely, if so, again, don't forget to like, subscribe, all right? And come and check us out on Patreon if you would love more readings and more content from my channel. I love you, Jim. Bye-bye.